Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Um, so I will be the first to admit that these holes are getting a little bit crazy. I've done so many. Um, but I have two holidays coming up so I've been doing quite a bit of shopping. Even though this is a winter haul. Um, typical. Um, and then also it's just, I think I've said so many times before, excuse after excuse. But when I move house, proper like styling videos, skincare, all that kind of stuff will be happening. And that is in like three weeks time. So bear with me. Um, but today I'm going to be doing a Zara haul. I did actually go in there yesterday, yeah yesterday, with the intention, I've got my big bag here, um, with the intention of getting bits for my holidays. I'm going to Amsterdam and then I'm going to the south of France. So Amsterdam will probably be a bit like the UK weather. Um, so I might get away with some of the bits for there but the south of France is going to be quite hot and I've just gone shopping for winter stuff by accident. <laughs> so um, it's the winter haul or an autumn winter haul. Um, so yeah, I picked up a few bits yesterday. So before I go into the haul, this video is actually in collaboration with 21 Buttons, which is basically an Instagram shopping app. So it is an app, it's available on iOS and Android, um, and you basically upload your pictures to it. I have a profile, so I'll do a screen record in a minute and show you how it works. But um, you basically upload any kind of picture you want to it, so whether it's on your Instagram or not, doesn't matter and you tag each piece of item, each piece of item? Each item um, with like a button and when you click on that button it will bring you to the website and give you the exact link to that exact piece of clothing which is great, so Instagram you can tag the brand but you can't actually tag like the actual item if you know what I mean so it's very very easy, amazing to use. But it's not actually just for shopping, it's also completely up to you how you use it. So you can use it for inspiration, you can use it for like shopping wish lists, which is what I've actually been doing. I've been making, well I'll show you, making like um, little folders for like holiday or shoes or jackets. So when you want to go shopping, say you're going shopping like tomorrow morning, you can just go onto your um, wardrobes or your safe collections and like look at all the things you've saved to get inspiration. Something else that I actually really love about the app is I get asked all the time like how would you pair these this pair of shoes with this outfit or what, what else would you wear that top with or can you tell me how you styled that? Um, and this app actually if you click on an item then it will like show you a com it's a combined feature. So, so with this app if you're stuck on how to style up an item maybe at all or more than once then you just click the combine feature and it will give you lots of different ideas of how to style it. So say for example this top, which is from Misguided, um, say that you weren't sure how you wanted to wear it, you would, if I uploaded this one to my account, you would click the combine feature and then it will show you everyone else's pictures that's actually wearing it, so it gives you all these different style inspirations, which I think is such a good feature. I especially love it for um, Zara, because Zara website is so hard to use, like, <laughs> I literally can't stand it. I say like a jumper, like a thin knit, is from Zara, you guys are always like, please can you send me the link, because I literally can't find it, and I don't blame you, because I even struggle to find things on that website. But rather than me just saying to you, oh it's from Zara, and then you having to trudge through that website, you just go onto my 21 buttons account and if I have tagged that button or that item um, with the button then you just click that button and it will automatically take you to the website. So I'm going to actually show you now on my phone. So I'm just going to screen record this for you. So this is my account. Um, I have 19 buttons which means I've linked 19 pieces of clothing. I'm following 84 people and I have 6 followers. So you can go through my account here. Um, you can go on the, oh, I'm going to talk to you about that picture in a minute, but on the homepage you literally just scroll and anything that you want or like, you just click and then it will take you to that website. Um, another thing I love, so say for example these joggies I think are an amazing like airport outfit, so you can click save and then maybe create a new closet, I haven't actually got an airport one at the minute, I'll click airport and then click done and now it will be saved into my personal folder for like airport outfit inspirations. Um, so yeah I think it's really good and then the combine outfit, so let me show you here, if you click combine it will show you everyone else who's wearing that outfit and how they've styled it, which I think is such a good feature. So here's my page. So this outfit here, I actually haven't uploaded it to Instagram yet because I took this picture and I was like, eh, I can get better. <laughs> so on my page, for example, these top two um, outfits, I haven't actually put on Instagram yet because I haven't, I didn't really like them enough to put on my page, but I know for a fact people are going to love the outfits. So I've just put them up here anyway, so they're not really anywhere else online but I know this jacket is going to be really popular, I'm going to show it to you in a minute. So I've just tagged it there, you can visit the website and it will take you straight to that link. There we go. And then you see the jacket, same with like the boots, I haven't put on, well I have put on Instagram but not this picture. So you can visit the website and it will take you there as well. Like so. 
Um, so yeah, I just think it's a really great app. It's so easy to use. So I will leave the description down below for you to download the app. But without further ado, let's get into the haul. As I said at the start of this video, I did have all intentions of getting some more like summery pieces, but because it was just miserable outside and I was just in the mood. Zara have all their winter stuff in, so I was like, yes, please. So I went a bit, um, no, I didn't even go crazy. I probably only have like seven items. The first thing I picked up yesterday was this black knit. I actually already own this jumper. I think I've actually owned it like twice before over the last couple of years. Um, but my most recent one, my twin has stolen it. So <laughs> I thought I should pick myself up another one. It's so nice. It's not too thick. It's like, it's a big jumper, but the knit is actually quite thin, which I really like. Um, so, you know, you can like see through it. <laughs> you probably can't see that. But believe it or not, I don't actually have any, well, now that Nicole, my sister, took this one, I don't actually have any other black oversized jumpers so I obviously have to get this um, it's very very plain and simple it's just really really long um, this is a size small and I think yeah so that's the smallest size you can get uh, it is actually really long on me so I've just been like tucking it into my jeans so it kind of like hangs over um, just a great piece for like autumn winter isn't it and the weather's so horrible right now in England like I just want to cuddle up in jumpers like this so yeah it's really really cute easy to style um, perfect with black jeans leather jackets boots you know just a really cozy outfit so it has quite a wide neck, which I like, and it has um, really big cuffs, actually. Let me show you. So it has really, really big cuffs. I've just been rolling them because, again, it is really long for me. And then the bottom has, like, quite a big, thick, like, rimmed hem. It's probably not going to show up too well. But, yeah, I really, really love it. So this one was $29.99. I've definitely said before, like, if you want knitwear, go on Zara or go on H&M. Like, their stuff's amazing. You guys will probably have seen this on Instagram because that's where I first discovered it on a few girls. Oh, it's so gorgeous. So it's just this really, really long, oversized, kind of like shapeless camel coat, and I just love it. The colour isn't actually that camel, it's kind of more of a nude. I just say camel, it's like a light camel. Um, it's just gorgeous. I actually have this in navy, which I got like two years ago. Um, and then I have this one now, and there is actually a khaki one, and I've been eyeing it up, but uh, it's quite expensive. So this one was £119, if I'm correct, and I got this in an extra small. Um, so yeah, it's just a really, really nice coat. It's double breasted, it has big buttons, and it has two big pockets either side, which I love. Again, this one's quite long for me, so I have just rolled the sleeves up, which I also think looks cool. It gives it quite like a casual look. And this is going to be so cute with like hoodies paired underneath it and chunky trainers, but also dressed up with heels, leather trousers, and like over the shoulders for a dinner outfit when it gets a little bit colder. Um, but yeah, that is that one, and I literally, I'm so in love with it. Okay, moving on, I was actually looking, well I wasn't looking, but I came across and decided I needed it, um, for an airport outfit, and I, I'm really boring with the airport, I've kind of never really understood like airport outfits until recently, and I'm like, you guys are killing it, like everyone on Instagram looks so cool at the airport, and I've just never been like that, so I picked up these, so I did try this set on in black ages ago, actually not that long ago, probably like a three weeks ago <laughs> um, and I don't know why I didn't get it I just don't think it suited me that well but then I went in and I saw it on, in khaki and I was like okay, I'm gonna give it another chance and I actually loved it so it's just this well it's two separate pieces but it's a set you know um, so it's these trousers they've got an elastic waist they've got pockets and the straight leg um, again I've been rolling I'm rolling everything I've been rolling up the bottoms um, just once and I just think they're a really, really nice airport outfit. They're nice, thin material, not see-through. It's going to be really, really comfy in um, when you're travelling. But also, I'm going to wear these in England, <laughs> of course. Not just, oh, sorry, my legs are really sore. Not just, like, at the airport. They're just a really nice, like, casual two-piece to have. But that's why I wish I got it in black, because I think it's going to look really nice with um, a leather jacket and loafers, like, here. <laughs> um, so anyway, this is the matching top. Again, just really, really simple. Same colour, just quite a nice little piece to have. The top I got in a medium because I like to tuck my tops in and have them hanging over. Uh, I could have actually done with a large to be honest. So the top's in a medium and the bottoms are in a small. They didn't do an extra small but I could have done with an extra small but still it's fine. I love them. So that was that one. I'm not sure of the prices. I think these were around 15 or £20 and the top was maybe like £12. Zara's really good for their prices with this kind of stuff. Um, so yeah, that was that one. Next, I picked up this little knit quite a while ago again. <laughs> I keep saying a well. while. I picked it up when I picked these up, so it was a few weeks ago now. Um, <clears throat> and also, I saw this one in lots of different colours as well, and I just decided to be good, and I only picked up this one colour. So it just looks like this. It's so soft. I wish you guys could feel it. It's such a nice material. also just love the colour. I wear a lot of black and a lot of, like, 
neutral colours and I think it's just going to be really nice with them. I have worn this a few times but I don't think I've taken a picture of it yet. So this one was £17.99 and I got it in a size small and it's just such a flattering little knit. You can wear this again so many different ways. You can wear it with heels, you can wear it for dinner but also under leather jackets and jackets when it's like in the day. It's kind of elasticated so it has like a nice hang to it when it's on you. So when I went into the shop yesterday I actually was trying to find it in black. I'm not sure if they don't do it in black or if we just didn't have it in black but I found it in the closest thing to that so <laughs> I picked up this one in grey. It's the, well, it's kind of not quite black on there. This is definitely grey. It's kind of, it's a very dark grey but um, it's definitely grey. So exactly the same, it was £17.99 and it's a size small and they're just such nice little tops to have. If I do come across this in the black, I'm going to pick it up. But also there was definitely other colours. I feel like there was a khaki. And I also feel like there was a red, but I might be making that up. But I do want to get this in a few more different colours because it's such a nice little top. Next is another airport outfit, but also just a really nice loungewear. I'm really excited to get this one on with trainers. I think it's going to look really cool. So, um, this comes in two different colourways, so it comes in this one and then it comes, I think it was, this part would be black and these parts are like orange and green, I think, and I did pick them both up and I was like, I'm going to just get one. So, it's just this little set, again, it's two separate pieces, but it is a set, um, so the bottoms were 17 99 and they're a size small, a really nice, not tight on me, so I do, again, Wish, I think this only comes, yeah, so the smaller size is the small, where I really could have done with an extra small, but it's fine. Um, it has this elasticated band around the waist. Um, they're just plain, straight leg, again, they have this stripe all the way down the side, which I really like. It's got a black and a white bit, I'm not sure if that's going to show up. But um, a little black stripe and then a white stripe, and then the bottoms are stitched into a roll. Is that going to show up? There you go. This little roll just makes them look a little bit more put together and a little bit more like... Um, daytime or I'm a bit funny about wearing joggies out in the day I find um it's not really my thing but I'm trying to get into it and I think having this little roll that's kind of like a tailored joggy you know so it makes them look a little bit more well to me acceptable <laughs> to wear during the day but yeah I just thought they were so cute I do have to roll the waistband though because they are quite long but once I've done that it's fine so I thought they were going to be really cool with trainers or with loafers for traveling and also in the day and then the little matching top is literally identical to this grey one I just showed you. It's like this. <laughs> but it has the matching stripes around the sleeves. I just thought it was a really nice piece. Um, again, the same really soft material. Oops, that way, sorry. Looks like that. Very, very simple. This one I got in a small. Um, $12.99. I think I said bottoms, but they were $17.99. So what's that? 20, 30, it's around £35 right yeah it was around 35 pounds for both of them which i think is so great so i should have maybe picked the other one up <laughs> um but i'm gonna see how much i wear this and if i do end up wearing it loads i'm gonna get the other one because i love them so i'm thinking with like chunky chunky trainers and then i found this jacket and i was like that's my outfit completed <laughs> so if you guys follow me on instagram you'll know that i'm a leather jacket fiend this one is full but oh my god it's stunning i've already had this jacket in black from there a few years ago and i wore it to death I ended up like ripping all the lining and stuff because I just used to wear it all the time. So when I saw it in red, I was like, yes, so nice. So it just looks like this. I just love it. I love the colour of red. I think it's showing up really, really red on there. It's more kind of like a muted red. It's also looking quite shiny, I think, in the camera because of the light, but you'll see it in the cutaway. It's just absolutely stunning. I love it. Very, very like bikery red. It's got silver hardware and, and it has this, um, oh, this buckle all the way around. Buckle? buckle belt, belt, <laughs> waist belt, I don't know, around the hem. Um, it has little pockets, I mean I probably wouldn't use them but I do love the all the detailing and all the silver hardware. I thought this over my shoulders with that little grey outfit and some chunky trainers is going to look really cool in my head, we'll see. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it was really cheap as well. Yeah this was 49 I picked this up and tried it on and was expecting to pay around like 65 to 70 pounds but I think under 50 pounds is well, by a penny. It's really really great. Um, it does probably, I think you can probably tell this looks like a full leather jacket, but I actually don't really mind. I really like the colour of it and it's probably something I'm not going to reach for that much because of the colour. So I don't really mind it being full, whereas the black ones I have, I love them because they are real leather and I do wear them all the time and they will keep me warm. This I actually tried on as well with the big black jumper I showed at the start. Even though that jumper is huge, it does fit well underneath this. So I got this one, yeah, so this comes from extra small all the way up to extra extra large 
I usually would pick up an extra small but because I want it to fit over my jumpers I did go for a small and yeah I'm really happy with it I actually love it so much so yeah that's that one okay that is everything not too many things but lots of um what's the word versatile pieces so again lots of things you can wear in lots of different ways which is exactly how I love shopping um I don't know if I've actually done a proper Zara haul before I think I've always like incorporated it in I don't think I've done an actual Zara haul so I hope you guys like this the links will be on my 21 buttons account over the next few weeks probably not that long probably the next like five days I'm going to try and get lots of pictures up the weather is rubbish so a lot of the pictures probably won't make it to my Instagram but I will always be uploading on there it's a nice way for me to have like wasted wasted pictures be put to use so um i don't want them on my instagram page because they maybe don't fit the feed or the picture's rubbish but i know that you guys will love the content so um that's what i'm going to start doing these will all be up there soon so make sure you follow me the link will be in the description box um and i think that is everything um if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and also make sure to hit subscribe for me and um i think that's it all i will see you next time bye